Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We are just going to see what comes up. This is for the month of April. Move this a little bit closer here. So, yeah, this is for April. What do we have for Capricorn? Huh. When that happens, I have to take it. I have to take it. So if something is happening where, you know, getting closer. I think you're getting closer to somebody or something like that. And there could be a level of unexpected. I got to take this. I got to take it. Whatever that means to you. I got, I just, this is something I got to take. However that resonates with you. Ooh, the Nine of Cups reversed. So the Nine of Cups reversed is feeling unsatisfied, dissatisfied, um, not happy about a situation. Um, but things are about to get better. I think you've been in a dissatisfying situation and now you are deepening a bond. I feel like you are starting to deepen a bond with somebody. That's what I feel. I feel like there's a deep connection that is coming. I think it's deep. I want to keep saying deep. Things are looking up. I think that I you, you need to wish for what you want. Think about it and wish for it and it will come. You, maybe you've been dissatisfied. You've been wishing and you've been praying and it hasn't been happening. I think it's about to happen, whatever this is, um, which is interesting with that card being reversed. There's definitely been a level of dissatisfaction, but you are about to deepen a bond. Deep fulfillment is coming, whatever that means. What do we got? Seven of Wands reversed. You may be feeling, you may have felt like you were under attack. But I think if if you are feeling like you were under attack, I think that you should be starting to feel some sort of relief. I feel like this is this is like giving up, giving up on the fight. I'm not going to fight about it anymore. I just want happiness. You know what I mean? That kind of energy. Uh, it's like stepping down, stepping, you win, you win. Um, I'm not going to fight this anymore. I'm, I'm done fighting it. All I want is happiness. I just want happiness. Seven of pentacles reversed. Now there's been a lack of, of investment. You haven't been investing in something in your own wish fulfillment. You haven't been investing in your own wish fulfillment. You haven't been nurturing yourself. You haven't been taking care of yourself enough. You've had your guard up. You've had a lot of people pointing their finger at you. You felt attacked. You felt like you were up against the world. You were probably feeling very overwhelmed by the changes that you've been experiencing in your life. I feel like... Um, you may have been holding on to a dead end for quite some time, but now you're giving it up. It's like, I'm done. I'm done. I just want to be happy. So I feel like that's where you're at. It's like, I realize there's no more growth. I got to be realistic here. I got to stop fighting for something that's never going to happen. You know, it's like I've, I surrender. That's what I feel like this is. I surrender. I surrender to, to what is. I'm not going to... Uh, try to make something be that isn't meant to be. It's like I'm, I'm giving up. I'm giving up on uh, trying to control the situation. I'm, I'm trying to win. I don't want, it's not about winning anymore. It's just about happiness. It's just, it's just a newfound um, appreciation for happiness, right? That's what I feel like this is. Um, King of or knight. I don't know why I said king. Knight of wands. So this is a sudden, this is a sudden change, a sudden a desire, a new desire. Okay. I feel like you are moving in a new direction, uh, taking action. You're done thinking about it. It's clear. It is very clear. You're done thinking about it. You may be having somebody that has just entered your life that is uh, very attractive to you. So we could have somebody 
uh, coming in, this person um, is attracted. They're very attracted to you. Um, they're very passionate. This person is um, adventurous. And now you need to make a decision. You need to make some sort of decision. Let's just get some more cards here. Page of Wands reversed. Knight of Pentacles. So, Capricorn. It feels like there's been, I mean, the Page of Wands reversed is bad news. It's a setback. It's bad luck. You may have been in a situation that failed to launch, right? And you may be very pessimistic right now. Maybe you're feeling a little cold. You're feeling um, like you don't really want to open up. You may be closing yourself off a little bit emotionally. There's not a lot of emotions here. You need to open yourself up. You need to communicate. Communication is key to making something um, work, just so you know. Um, this is being very pessimistic. So I feel like you're, 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 you may have some fear. Okay. You may have some fear. You, you may be procrastinating. You may be trying to hold somebody back. It's like you have somebody coming into your life that is, um, this person is, they may be forceful, put it that way. This person may want it right now. They may want you to commit right now. They may want you to, um, come with them right now. Just come with me right now. You know, this is kind of person seems to be a little forceful. They move fast. Somebody that has entered your life is a fast, this person is a fast uh, mover. Okay. They don't procrastinate and you may be trying to, you know, bide some time trying to push them back while you're thinking, right? You're trying to make a logical decision here. You've always done that, right? Let's be logical here. Let's be logical. But right now, it feels like you, you need to remember it's about your happiness. You don't need to, don't try to hold on to something that isn't practical. So I think that this, there's some sort of fear here. There's fear of, of, uh, letting your guard down. I think that you are fearful to let your guard down. I think you're trying to be practical. You're trying to get, build financial stability. You're trying to build, uh, uh, yourself up some sort of stability okay that's why you want to move slow it's like you want to move slow but you got somebody else that wants to move fast so I think that you're dealing with that you're dealing with that dynamic here and you're very pessimistic um, I think that you know this person wants you to make a decision they want you to make a choice so they're probably pushing you somebody is probably pushing you pushing you probably to choose them or to give them a chance or something like that um, but you, you're guarded, you're guarded. And I think that you're, you're wanting to, to slow this person down because you're trying to build yourself up. You want to make sure that you're making the right decision. Um, page of pentacles. If somebody wants you to give them a chance, you're going to be given an opportunity. Okay. An opportunity to go down a path with somebody that could lead to something long term. So this is a new opportunity you're going, you're being given. Somebody wants to, uh, or they're giving you, they're giving you this opportunity to start from scratch, to start over, to try something new, but it's not easy because you've never, uh, or you just, you're scared. You're scared to do this. You don't, you don't know if you can do it. You don't know if you're going to be successful. So there's definitely a level of fear. Um, I think you're laying down a new foundation with somebody. Um, you're deepening a bond with this person. I think that you are trying to be very practical. Um, but you're, I also see determination here. I see you working really, really, really hard. And I got to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. I see you working really hard to make wise decisions. You know, I think that you're just trying to build up your stability right now, your money, your bank account, um, yourself, right? I feel like you are trying to be very, very, very realistic. Um, but whoever you're dealing with wants this right now. Okay. They want it now. And you're probably like trying to, uh, push them back. Whoever you're dealing with um, has low self-worth, okay? So whoever it is that is pushing you, 
has low self-worth. That's why they want your commitment or they want your attention so badly. They want you to uh, basically say, you know, you're committed to them or something like that because they're, 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 they have low self-confidence. They've been rejected. They've been rejected a few times. So that's why they're pushing you. Um, but I do feel like you are, you are going to go down this new path maybe reluctantly. I feel like you're probably going to give this person a chance and I feel like it's probably the right decision because this person has real feelings for you. Okay. This person has real feelings. You are definitely going to be getting, um, messages of love. You're going to be getting affection from somebody. This person is loving. This person is caring. This person is going to show you their true feelings. Um, this person really, really admires you and I feel like they want to build, they want to build a foundation with you. And I feel like this person has follow through, you know, they, 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 they really feel like you have potential. They trust you. Um, for some reason they trust you. They, they feel some sort of a deep attraction to you and they want to build a, they want to build a foundation. I think they want to build a foundation with you. Um, Wow, the world card. So that is the success card. That is a new beginning. This is that the chapter of your life that you have been struggling to let go of. You know, that, that chapter is over. That phase of your life is over. You are about to engage or embark on a, on a whole new life. This is a major new beginning when you get the world card. This is leaving the past behind and moving towards the future. This is being in the flow, being recognized for your hard work, being recognized for your perseverance. You are going to be recognized for putting in effort to leave behind that situation that didn't uh, progress, okay? It didn't progress with these two cards, with these three cards. But now you are, you're moving into something more fruitful. You're moving into something more uh, logical. Okay. But you gotta let go of your fear. You gotta let go of your fear. The reason that didn't launch or that didn't, um, last is because it was unrealistic. It's like whoever you were dealing with was, um, very defensive that whoever you were dealing with in the past was, was always, was a fighter. Okay. This person was a fighter. They wanted to fight about everything. It was like they, they had to win at all costs and you can't really be with somebody like that who you can't, it's not, you can't always be their way. It has, you know, it takes two. You have to be able to compromise and whoever you were dealing with, they were very unrealistic. It was always, uh, it's like they didn't, they wanted you to nurture them, but they didn't want to nurture you. So I feel like that, that didn't, that didn't grow the way it was supposed to because, you got this other person, obviously it didn't grow because they, it just wasn't meant to be. But anyway, um, you have somebody here that is going to put in effort. They are very attracted to you. They have real feelings for you. And I feel like they are willing to prove to you. They're willing to prove to you that they want to have a, you know, they want to have a life with you. They want to be a part of your next chapter. They want to be a part of your, your success. They know that you're going to be successful. They have faith in you. They believe in you. So I feel like you got somebody here that is going to help you. They're going to help you, um, to prosper in some way, whoever this person is. So I think that last phase of your life is over and you're about to, uh, you know, start on a new journey. You've learned some sort of lesson because the world card is a lesson learned. And this lesson has to do with perseverance. It has to do with following through. It has to do with putting in effort. It has to do with, um, making logical decisions. It has to do with not choosing based on looks as well, because this is somebody with an image problem, a self image problem, the page of wands reverse that may have been very attractive to you in the past. You know, you gotta, it's not about the looks. It's about, uh, the feelings. It's about, um, who a person is on the inside. So anyway, I feel like, um, you have a new opportunity here with this world card. You've learned a lesson. You have learned a lesson and you are about to embark on a new, a new endeavor. Okay. This is a new endeavor 
where you are basically given this opportunity and this opportunity can grow. It can grow into something long term. It can grow into something prosperous. It can grow into something solid. You know, all it takes is hard work. So as long as you put in effort, it's going to grow and it's going to be successful. So I see a successful opportunity coming to you and you uh, working with it. Okay, I think that you're going to work with it. I think that you're going to take this opportunity. Um, this is a new partner. This is very exciting. This is a new, uh, a new I mean, this could be a new sexual partner. This is a new exciting vision. This is, uh, this is your match. Okay, this is your match. You may have met your match. So this is, this is just go for it. Just take the opportunity. So Capricorn, you're being, you're, you're, you got an exciting opportunity that is coming to you that will grow. It is going to grow. Um, you are probably dealing with, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, could be a Aries, Leo, or oh, not Aries, yeah, no, yeah, could be a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and also, it could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio as well. First card is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But this person, I think that's who you're deepening a bond with. You may be deepening a bond with somebody that uh, feels rejected. This person needs love. This person needs love. And, you know, they're, they're waiting for you. They're waiting for you to give them a chance. And I think that you should. I think that you should just go for it. This could lead to a successful uh, endeavor, put it that way. This is a golden opportunity to build a foundation with somebody that could really grow pretty fast. Okay? It could. By 2021, you could be uh, very stable, put it that way. Um, but you have to make a decision. You have to make a decision to let go of your fears. Because there's fears here. You have to you have to be logical and you need to communicate. Make sure that you are not uh, not communicating. You need communication is key. It's key. So there is somebody there is somebody here that you are going to have a mutual attraction with. Um, this person uh, is going to communicate with you, and it will be up to you to reciprocate. Um, Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Now this is a queen. This is somebody of value. This is somebody of value. Somebody that knows their value. Somebody that is hardworking. So we have a hard worker here. Very generous, down to earth, sensual. A homemaker, abundant, fertile, stable. So we have this stable queen. She's stable. I feel like she's been taken advantage of, though. But this queen has a new beginning. That struggle is going to be behind her. Her value is increasing. It is. Her value is increasing. Her hard work is paying off. So we have, we have this Queen of Pentacles that is getting an exciting opportunity. It happens suddenly. This happens very suddenly. It's like a sudden spark or a sudden attraction. Or a sudden desire to go down this new path. All of a sudden, things change. So this is definitely getting an offer that is very stable and long term. You have definitely learned a lesson. And this lesson is definitely about self-worth. It's about deep fulfillment. It's about... Moving too fast is about being logical. There's definitely a lesson that has been learned. You're about to step into a whole new world. 
By 2021, you will probably be in a very stable, solid, long-term commitment with somebody that is a perfect match. Good luck.